Hello. In this video I'll be helping you with the Alex problem type called solving an absolute value equation problem type 2. We're asked to solve for v and before moving on we have an absolute value equals a number and just to check to see if there's no solution. Since the absolute value is equal to a positive we should be able to solve the equation. However if the absolute value would have been equal to a negative say a negative 4 we could have stopped here and said there's no solution because the absolute value could not be negative. Since that's not the case, I'm going to move forward by removing the absolute value. And when we have an absolute value equals a positive, there are two possibilities. We could drop the absolute value and say 4v plus 8 equals 4. But the other possibility is that the value inside the 4v plus 8 equals a negative 4. So to remove the absolute value, we're going to have two possibilities. Either it equals the positive value that was expressed outside, or it could be the opposite of that, the negative value, because taking the absolute value of a negative 4 would make it a positive 4. Moving forward with our two solutions here, we can solve the expression on the left by subtracting 8 from both sides. To isolate the v, we now have 4v equals negative 4. Dividing by 4, the 4s we cancel on the left, leaving me v equals negative 1. And that is one solution. Or, from the right-hand side, we would do the same process to isolate the v. Subtracting the 8 from both sides, this time gives me 4v equals negative 12 and dividing by 4 on both sides, giving us v equals negative 3. So we have two solutions. We would separate them by a comma when entering them. And again, the reason we have two solutions is the absolute value, in this case 4v minus 8, could either be a positive 4 or a negative 4. Either way, taking the absolute value would give us that positive 4 that it's being said equal to.